Please take your seats quickly, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Hi guys, welcome to OneMinuteTennis.com. In today's session, I want to talk to you about watching the ball. I want to talk to you about the process of watching the ball and to give you a practical example of how by watching the ball the way the professional players do, you can actually hit more efficiently, more powerfully and more consistently. Now watch the ball's got to be the most common phrase in tennis. And yet why do you need reminding to watch the ball? In my opinion, everybody is watching the ball every single time. I mean, for example, if I was playing and, uh, and I start to swing here and then say, oh no, it was a backhand, that would be not watching the ball. So what we really should say is watch the ball correctly, watch the ball efficiently. But is it that complicated? Surely we either watch the ball or we don't. What we've made here is a video where we have a camera on the head of the player so we can see his view as he plays the ball and a camera watching what he does. They're synchronized perfectly so you can actually see the different processes. And he's not watching the ball all of the time. What happens is he looks up and he will watch the player. And then from what the player does with the ball, he will get a lot of information on what the ball is likely to do. You see, the difference between that and that is enormous. And therefore, the brain will track the ball much more efficiently in the first part of its journey because it's already got all the information there. It's already got all the data. So by not watching the ball, by watching the player, then the brain has a lot of clues and a lot of information so it can predict and anticipate what the ball is going to do. After the opponent hits the ball, then obviously the focus now needs to be intensely on the ball. And we track the ball, trying to follow it with the head, not with the eyes, with the head fixed, but trying to follow it with the head until around contact. At contact, the head should stay very still. This is for balance, right? It's very important that the head is static. When we move the head, we lose balance. So the head stays still, and so we will either see contact or we'll see the court or a view of something, but no ball for a fraction of a second. And now we look up and we don't find the ball. The ball will be in peripheral vision. We see the opponent. So the process of watching the ball becomes opponent, ball, contact. Opponent, ball, contact. Opponent, ball and contact. With this process, you will find that the ball appears to slow down. In reality, it's the mind speeding up as it's got more information and can process it more efficiently. I hope this makes sense. Try and apply this to your game or your player's game. It really makes an enormous difference. And this is how every professional player, every professional sports person, this is how they watch the ball. Let us know how this works for you. You know, we love your feedback and we always reply to every single comment. Also, if you want to try and practice this in your local area, then have a look at our partners, playyourcourt.com. Their information's on the screen now. They actually send professional tennis coaches direct to your area and to your local court. It's a very special service and we've got a great discount. If you click on the link that's below this, then there's a 50% discount off their membership uh, with that link. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel, please. Makes a big difference to us. And remember, if you need more help with your game and really want to take your game to the next level, then have a look at our service. The website is below. We do one-to-one -one online lessons, consultations, video analysis, and a whole lot of other stuff. Most of the video lessons that you see on YouTube are actually designed for players that we're working with for us as specific lessons tailor-made to help them with their game. Thanks for watching and see you next time for more unique tennis lessons that really work.